Hey everyone, Ross McCorkle here with another episode of the Depot 180. The 2023 NFL season is officially underway with the Detroit Lions upsetting the Kansas City Chiefs in Arrowhead Stadium in the Thursday night season opener. The AFC figures to be extremely tough, so this loss for the Chiefs certainly could come back to bite them in the AFC standings at the end of the season. Back on Tuesday's episode of the 180, a lot was up in the air with the Steelers' Sunday opponent, the San Francisco 49ers. What a difference a few days can make as Nick Bosa signed a record-breaking contract in time for the season. It's still possible he could play slightly less snaps than he would have under normal circumstances, but he will play and play a lot. This is why the Steelers were vocal about their preparation for Barbosa to play. They didn't want to be surprised and underprepared. They are prepared. Not that this makes it an easy task. Bosa can and will wreck the game if you let him. Dan Moore Jr. will get his first huge challenge of the year, and Chooks Okorafor, too, for that matter. Bosa lines up on both sides. Brock Purdy, not that there was much doubt, but he will be playing as well. It is questionable if he is 100%, but he was medically cleared, so he must be pretty darn close and have no elevated risk of re-injury. Star tight end George Kittle was unable to practice fully all week with a groin injury and is officially labeled as questionable, but I think that's another case of you prepare as if he's going to be there regardless. Jake Moody, their kicker, Ray Ray McLeod, and Talanoa Hufunga were cleared to play while Charvarius Ward joined Kittle as the only two questionable. For the Steelers, Cam Hayward was limited throughout the week with an illness, but he told media he will be playing. The biggest question mark remains Larry Ogunjobi, who is questionable with his foot injury. That could be a key matchup to exploit for the 49ers' potent run game if Ogunjobi cannot go. And a big opportunity for a guy like Marvin Liao, Armon Watts, and even Keanu Benton, the rookie. Javon Hargrave will be returning to Acrisure Stadium to play in front of what used to be a home crowd for him. You can be certain that Bosa, Hargrave, and Eric Armstead, among others, will pose a serious test for this offensive line that should be much improved over the last year. Let me know how you enjoyed the video on Twitter at Ross underscore McCorkle, and as always, visit SteelersDepot.com for your latest and greatest Steelers breaking news and analysis.